Hello everyone. So this is the technique series and we're going to start with C major. And now you will understand what did I said in the previously uh, video about the scale. If you didn't watch it, please watch it because it's very short and right to the point and you'll understand better right now when I'm going to explain you the most important um, the scale that it is C major. So as I said, uh, any scale, every scale, it's a, a series of eight keys that they are arranged by pitch. And as in C major, as I said, um, it started with C and ends with C and we're gonna go playing them one after the other one all the way through. So from C to C, we're having seven keys, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, plus the last one that it's repeating of the uh, first one. So that's why it's a scale arranged by um, pitch. There are eight keys, played it in order as they come, in which we don't repeat any of them right so it's c d e f g a b c how to play this scale okay so as i said we having four uh we having seven keys so three plus four makes seven right with the eight one that repeats on the top so it, we don't have seven fingers right we're only having five fingers so in that case we group them so we play first one two three and then the finger number one, okay, the thumb goes under it and plays the next four keys. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to repeat again. So we're having a set of three and then a set of four. And then with the five one, it's repeating the same keys. One, two, three, underneath. One, two, three, four. And going down, we're gonna go backwards exactly as we went up. One, five, finger number five, four, three, two, one, over, and we're gonna play three, two, one. Repeats again. One, two, three, under, thumb under, one, two, three, four, five, and then see, five, four, three, gonna go exactly opposite five four three two one so we we don't know what to do now what we're gonna do obviously we're gonna turn number three three two one and then we're gonna go backwards one two three under under thumb under and we're gonna play the next four keys one two three four and then we're gonna end with a five again five four three two one over three two one and then backwards one two three under one two three four five it's definitely not that hard if you want to have a little bit of fun i'm going to give you a tip here you see, you, if you place your thumb, both uh, hands on the C, and if I'm gonna go opposite with my hands, right? Don't be afraid and just do it. One, two, three, under, both thumbs goes under. One, two, three, four, and I'm gonna make C, and I'm gonna go back. So if you pause right now the video, 
and then you practice a little bit of the right hand, a little bit about, you know, 10 times, left hand about 10 times, just to make sure that you are, you know, comfortable with going under or over, now finger number one, uh, and then you put it together, that would be awesome. Before you put it together in a parallel way, not in an opposite way, like I did before, split one, you know, you really need to know them very well, you need to know uh, very well uh, in a separate hands, okay? Right now, if I wanna place it on the both hands, right? I'm gonna go like that. This. So first I'm gonna pay attention to the right hand because after three keys, uh, the thumb goes under on the right hand. So here is the tricky part. And then right now I'm gonna turn my attention to the left hand and play this. So practically we will have number three, number three both hands exactly on the same uh, on the same finger on A and then you just figure it out all the way through it. I'm gonna go again. So first I'm paying attention to the um, to the right hand. One, two, three, right hand under, the thumb goes under. One, two, and then the left hand in this moment goes over. And then this is going to be done. Alright? So you need to practice this for definitely 10, 20 times. Very slow. Very slow. And relax. And relax. And over. Right? So after you practice this, you wait for a day and then you're gonna go down, right? Descending. So you're gonna start from this one and where you're gonna pay attention. First, you're gonna pay attention to the left hand this time. Five, four, three. But here, left hand goes, the thumb goes under in this moment. And then the right hand goes over in this moment. And finger number three is going to be both on E, on both hands, E, and then D and C. I'm going to go again. This, so first, you pay attention to the right hand. And then left hand, three. This is the matching point. And finish it up. And then you go down. Left hand, pay attention here. Turns, the left hand turns here, under. And then right hand turns, both hands on three, and then you are done. So right now, the next step for you is just practice going down. Go slow, go slow for at least one or two days, okay? So one or two days going, you just practice going up, right? And then one or two days practice going down. I will repeat again. First time you practice the right hand. Second time you practice the left hand. Only, right? For one day right hand, one day left hand. Again on the next day right hand. And then the next day left hand by itself. Then if you want to have fun, you can put them split as I showed you uh, previously, right? Uh, and then... Little by little, you will try to do it uh, both hands in a parallel way. Parallel meaning go with both hands going up and then go both hands going down as I showed you. So you will go uh, both hands going up for about two days. And then another two days, both hands going down for another two days. And then you will go both hands going up and down. scales if you really really learn this scale very well you will be able to play at least uh let me think uh two four six eight eight scales they're just coming exactly the same thing the same thing obviously with sharps or more black keys involved but the fingering and the rotations and stuff like that it's going to go exactly the same so the feeling is the same 
So do practice this one. All right, so uh, what I'm gonna do right now, I'm gonna give you a little exercise for you to practice going up. So you can try this, you go one, one, one octave, and then for repetition and for more fun, you can start with D, going all the way up to D. to the two octaves um, uh, scale. It's very easy, very easy, very easy, okay? So click on the next one after you practice this one for, you know, one, one um, the exercise that I just gave it to you. Um, uh, do click on my next one and you'll learn how to play two octaves. Thank you very much. Click, like, subscribe and See you on the next video. I hope you enjoy our tutorials and my performances. Music Academy International is a non-profit foundation. Its goal is to provide financial support for talented pianists to study with international teachers. Please consider to become part of our Patreon family. Link below. By subscribing, five ten dollars a month will really go long way. All our family, friends, and students, uh, they do have access to our private channel called Master Piano Live with Liana, and where I am uh, holding a live seminar once a month. Thank you so much, and God bless you. Thank <music> you.